So I was going from one Ibu side to another and then this Russian board opened with picture of dead children in it. There was one picture that looked like taken from an SY room with a 10 years old boy. Cuts on fourth part. Literally the two legs in a packet upside down. There was other picture of dead children, very bloody. I don't know if it was true or fake. I just went away and never came back. There was also a website about the human experimentation. It does own kidnapped homeless people. It was only text and stuff true. So I supposed it may have been a hoaxed page, but they described it how they inserted those homeless people with random liquids that they found in their houses or on the street and then they would light them die from it and then sell their organs on black market on a debate. They also cure some described what fucked up Michelin would grow appear on them and they had photos of it very up close stranger quality videos from Iraq or something and all in one cramp warehouse all my debate notes links and debate search India and that onion said are on my old computer and I'm happy they are gone because curiosity kills and I wouldn't be able to hold myself back from getting back on a deep web. One day I was on the internet watching random videos when I came across one that talked about this thing called a DBAP. I don't know what a DBAP was so I googled it but couldn't find it. Then I read that you had to download a software called Tor so I did. I launched Tor and test the program by searching for it for sale. I couldn't find anything but I did find a website called The Hidden Wiki. I browsed the link that it provided and found a website that would allow me to buy my weed. I browsed through the different type of weed and found the kind that I like. I bought 3 grams of purple cash for 0 0.16 bitcoin which I had to farm using my GPU. I got at Best Buy as I was entering my delivery details a box popped up it was black at first so i tried to exit out of it no matter what i did the box wouldn't go away then all of a sudden the box started playing a video there was a man standing in a dark room i could only see his face and he was wearing a guy fuchs mask the video went to full screen and I was unable to move my mouse. The guy started talking in a deep tone that made it clear that he was using a voice changer. Hello there, Jack, how are you? He said. I felt paralyzed with fear. I looked at a man with an expression of fear on my face. Don't look at me like that, he said. I looked at a webcam and realized that it was on. I quickly unplugged it. Oh, you are no fun, he said, chuckling. Who the fuck? I muttered to myself. That's not important, now it is. He replied, I was shocked and realized that my microphone was still on. I was going to unplug it as well, but I decided that it would 
my only way to communicate with him. Tell me who the fuck you are or I will try my fucking computer off. I yelled. He laughed before replying. You can call me Carted. In that same demand Dixon tone. What do you want? I asked. My objective is simple. He replied. I'm here to spook you. He laughed again. Little did he know that I was already spooked before I responded to him. He spoke again. How is the weather in Atlantic? He asked. I began to panic. Not only did he know my name, but he also knew where I lived. I was angry now. Well, if you are so thought, then take off the mask. I yelled alone with a string of perfectly. Very well. He said as he removed his mask. What led beneath still chills me to this very day. He had no face but instead a skill. I was sure that it wasn't another mask or a dame. This was a legit man skeleton talking to me. I freaked out and started trying to unplug my computer but we stopped when he said if you go there then i will come to your house and kill your dog i looked at him and he laughed a timid laugh then he said well there is enough internet for you today as my screen start to turn to static all of the sudden it stopped and all the tabs that were open on my browser closed it. I tried to open up Google but was made with a no internet connection, decayed error. I checked my computer's internet and it said that it could connect it stayed this way for 20 minutes before allowing me to access the internet again. In the meantime, I was sure to completely uninstall the Tor browser. My weed was delivered normally, but even so, I never plan plan on visiting the deep web ever again. These goddamn spooky scare skeleton—they got me every time.